All right, so this is a quick tool video here. So I have a Styles Herman uh, hand type English wheel. This one was patented in 1919. So it's uh, one of the original designs, I suppose. So I'll take a quicker walk around this tool. So one thing you'll notice, uh, hopefully in the video, is that this is like a, a bronze carrier here. Then the wheel is made out of copper. This is a flat wheel. There's a uh, curved wheel that is made out of steel. It has uh, a way to put the pressure on it and it'll get you over any fender lips you might need to get over. There's a bit of play. The wheel slides back and forth on the shaft on both ends. I'm not sure if that's significant or not. So we have three and a quarter inches to the outside wheel, about uh, three inches to the brass or the copper wheel to the inside of the frame. And it's about four inches uh, space, moves up to about four and a half. There, the flat wheel is just a touch over one inch wide, I'd say it's an inch and a sixteenth. The narrow wheel is about, what is that? A sixteenth over three quarters. You think I could do the math, but I haven't done this in advance. Then uh, it opens one inch to get you over a fender lip. I'm going to take the diameter of the wheels. Big wheels about 1.9825. Small wheel is about 1.591. So I think it would be pretty easy to make these again if there was a big demand in the market. I don't know if there is or not. Because the reality is uh, two castings, a bolt, and uh, a couple wheels you could probably cut out with a lathe. So if there's any significant interest in that, let me know. I might investigate uh, seeing what it would cost to reproduce these. There's a bigger version of this that uh, I don't know if it's twice the size or not. I haven't got one of those yet. I may or may not go after it. I'm going to play around with this one first and see uh, if it's a real tool or not because I haven't seen anybody use one before or if it's more of a gimmick. And uh, But if it works for the fenders that I've got, I might go and chase down the uh, bigger one. So thank you.